All right, here we go. The first recipe that we are gonna be entertaining with, and please make sure that you have fun in doing this, is basically addressing difficulties with bowel function. The main ingredient is the simple gelatin, which in essence is not absorbable by the intestine, and consequently what it does is that helps to have good bowel movement. So, very simple. Any of these ingredients are easy to find. Anybody can use it. All these recipes are precisely designed for you. So, very simple. We are gonna start with the heavy cream and we are going to put it on our pan on the fire. And to that, I'm going to go ahead and add goat cheese. And this is going to melt into it. The goat cheese is going to give it not only the flavor, but on top of that, it's going to give you a lot of the nutritional part of it. Then I'm going to add a little bit of pepper. And the reason for the pepper is very simple. I am trying to stimulate your taste bud. Very simple, let me just give you a point. If I have this band of rubber, the band of rubber is gonna stay down without moving. If I actually stretch it out and let it go, it jumps. The taste bud in your mouth have lost the ability to jump. The pepper is like the stretching of the rubber to improve the taste. So I'm gonna add that to the pot. Then, once this gets warm up and dissolved, I am dissolving the cheese in the heavy cream and the, uh, uh, the pepper. And once I have it done, and it's totally out of lumps and everything is just well mixed, once it begins to be warm, then I'm going to be adding the gelatin. And remember, gelatin needs to be added whenever the liquid is hot so that it does not create lumps for you. So very gently, while I'm whisking on it, I'm gonna be adding it. And I can show you that it's already very nicely mixed on it. Now finally, what I'm gonna do is that I'm going to add a little bit of salt. And of course, how much of salt that is, it really and truly depends upon everybody else's taste. Now you have to be careful with this particular product because in essence what happened with it, if you heat it too much, it's just gonna foam up and it's gonna give you trouble with that. So I'm pretty much about ready with this. So the next step will be very simple as well. And what I have done with this is that these are my peppers and I have basically roasted them. And basically what I will do is that I will add to it just little slices of it. And this is gonna give it another point of any recipe and that is the color and the beauty. Remember, everything goes through your eyes. All right, so I'm ready to do this. So I'm going to get a couple of other elements. One of these is just a plain, simple, disposable pan, inexpensive, and I have some basil. And I will go ahead and get a few of these leaves of basil, which is gonna give me the beauty of the tasting in your mouth that cleans in it, which is heavily important to it. Then I have all the elements that I need, and I will go ahead and get then my product.
So uh, I have everything ready. So I'm going to start by putting some of these directly into my container. And I'm going to be adding the first layer with a little bit of basil. And I'm gonna be adding a little bit of the different colors of pepper. And then I go to the next level. And I'm adding another layer of basil and pepper. And it doesn't have to be in a special arrangement. I mean, it just fall randomly into it. And it will give it a beautiful taste it's gonna be a very refreshing taste to you, and it's gonna be a great deal of therapeutic value to your gastrointestinal tract. So once I have it done already, then I will take this to my refrigerator, and I will just basically let it rest until it gels. All right, so this is it, very simple. Anybody can do it, you can do it. Delicious, beautiful, nutrition, and above all ever seen, helping your taste and smell to be better. I hope you enjoy it, thank you. Goat cheese, pepper terrine, and the ingredients are uh, heavy cream, you have a um, goat cheese, you have salt, pepper, and you have roasted pepper and basil. The main reason for this recipe is to enhance bowel function. Thank you.